Hi there. One of the aspects of exam technique which can really make a difference, particularly in the new A-levels, is the quality of analysis, the quality of theoretical explanation. Many students tend to miss out parts of the chain of analysis. So in this session, we're just going to take a look at some examples of how you can build really good chains of analysis and get top marks for analysis. So analysis should take place, should occur through a clear chain of reasoning. And the best way to do this is to use analytical connective phrases. You've probably come across some of these before. As a consequence, therefore, this leads to, this is because. Use connective phrases to improve your analysis. So, for example, um, a lot of students might, might put this in their answer. Increase in interest rates will lead to a fall in inflation. Now that could be the case. Higher interest rates is a deflationary monetary policy and in theory, through the transmission mechanism, that will cause a fall in inflation. But what's missing from that line is a chain of reasoning. It's important to be able to put that in. So if you avoid a chain of reasoning, if you miss it out, it can be regarded as assertion rather than analysis. And it could be marked under the new A-levels as knowledge and not analysis. So how do we build a chain of analysis? Let's take our example. An increase in interest rates can possibly cause a fall in inflation. What kind of elements could be put into the linking of this chain? An increase in interest rates raises the cost of mortgage repayments on variable rates. This leads to a fall ineffective disposable income and consumption. So we've got two chains in the link already. And this fall in effective disposable income and consumption may cause the output gap to become negative, leading to a possible fall in inflation. Well, hopefully you see how this works. Here we have a chain of analysis. Instead of just saying an increase in interest rates leads to a fall in inflation, we put three elements into the chain. It doesn't have to be five or six, you just have to put some chains in there. And if you do, you'll score higher marks for analysis in the exam.